Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. It's your girl Mina Muslima, and welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome. Hi, my name is Amina, but everybody calls me Mina Muslima on social media. And if you're not new, girl, welcome back. It's a new vlog. So <laughs> today's vlog, um, we will be going to the 55th annual. Cairo International Book Fair. Oh my gosh, Ooh, I'm so excited. Like, um, this is our second year here and we went last year, but we didn't really get to enjoy the experience. Like one, like we had just moved here like a couple months before we found it out, found out about it last minute and really didn't get to plan. So this time we're actually going, my husband's um, getting some money right now so that when we go we got money to spend on um certain books i don't know exactly what i want but i i know when i see it like there's a couple things that i want to get and then also there's a couple things i want to get for my mom i'm super excited so this morning my husband went to the gym and um i stayed with the kids at home um i had to do some laundry i folded some laundry i washed some laundry and I waited for him to come back. When he came back, um, he got dressed. I got, I had the boys dressed already, but then I got dressed. Oh, the sun is coming out. Y'all listen, okay, I'm everywhere. But yeah, y'all listen, I thought we was gonna have to cancel this trip because it was super, super gloomy. It was really getting gloomy today. Um, somebody was behind the car. It was really getting gloomy. I was like, oh my gosh. And then it started sprinkling raining outside. I'm like, I do not want to go to a book fair. I mean, most of it's inside, but outside is where like the food and the vending is like, if you want to get something to eat and I'm hungry, I'm not gonna lie, I'm very, very hungry. <laughs> so, um, yeah, but now the sun is coming out, alhamdulillah. And you know, we are on the way. Uh, so yeah, he about to get some money right now. Um, earlier I had, I had, listen, being a mother of two, under two is no joke. I have a three month old and I have a one, one and a half year old. Like, girl, what were you thinking? <laughs> My kids are like 13 months apart. Anyways, so we're about to head to the uh, book fair. Um, right now we are in Nessa City. Uh, let me add a little bit of Arabic, hold up. <laughs> and then, not new. Medina T. Nasser. Um, Lekinne Badahuna Nathabu, Senathabu, Ile I really don't know exactly where it is, but uh oh, Farouk is acting up. But yeah, what, what, what? Are you hacking? Are you hacking? Hmm? Huh? Come on. Okay, so yeah. Um, what else was I gonna say? I forgot I had to say book fair. Oh my gosh. Or can I forgot. Oh my gosh, I can't believe I forgot how to say that. That was like level what three or four? But anyways, yeah. So that's where we're going today. It's not going to be a super, super long vlog because it's only us going to the book fair today. But I really hope you guys enjoy it. So next time um, when it comes around, maybe you'll visit Cairo and come check it out. All right. Oh, and also um, they have uh, most of the people that are selling books. Um, a lot of them come from out the country as well. So they'll probably share information. So if I can share some information for those that you know don't have the ability to come to Cairo but they still want to you know have access to these books I'll definitely try to share them as much as possible during the viewing I'll try to record as much as I can but yeah like that. Oh, y'all listen okay it's been a while since I've been able to really sit down and read a good book and I'm trying to that's one of my new year's like um, goals like something that I wanted to start um, trying to do is read more now like I'm not a new year goal type of person but January came around I'm like listen 
I feel like I don't read as much. So that's why I said it's New Year's goal. But the goal could have started yesterday. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, that's that's what we're doing now. So I not just Islamic books. I definitely want to get some like leisure reading books in Arabic to practice my uh, reading and comprehension. And then also um, Arabic books for learning as well. And then I wanted to get Muhammad some toys, some Arabic toys, some Arabic uh, uh, books, posters for his room because I've been fixing up his room too. But yeah, okay, that's it. I'm done. <laughs> done with the intro. Okay, so yeah, I'll link up with y'all. Well, not link up with y'all, but I'll get with y'all again when we get to the convention center. All right. Okay, don't mind the dirty windows. Listen, Egypt is in the desert, y'all. Okay, so as you can see, it is literally packed. Okay, you can see on that hill over there, it's a bunch of parking over there too. Yeah, it's mad people over there. Okay, you guys, that's the entrance right there. As you can see, it's a whole bunch of people. Um, they got security everywhere. Like I said, don't mind the dusty windows. We it's are right in, in the, the desert. We in the chest, we in the streets, man. We be outside. <laughs> <laughs> I can't. Ah, Egyptians drive up. It's rude. Yes. Oh my God. Yeah. Look at all these cars, y'all. Look, the parking lot goes all the way back there. There go the police, dab it. There go the dab it. Had to put the phone down because dab is out here, you know what I'm saying? Because <laughs> sometimes, you know, police be acting funny about you recording them sometimes. Oh, they towing cars out here. And that's another entrance. It's, it's not you can't see it, but it's behind the car. Okay, there's another entrance. One of these places we gotta go pay though. One gate we gotta pay. Yeah. You know, we don't remember like last year we pay. I think it might be this one. Look, it's one of these over here. Pay for. park over there because they got mad spaces over there even in the front mm -hmm. like y'all we've gone a good what what you say it's been like a mile we've been driving a little more but it's just been a slow, slow yeah it's been a slow mile trying to get to this side so we can get on the other side of this street and park that's what we're looking to do Space. What you mean? This a parking spot? Yeah, the whole line is full of cars. Okay. Yeah, we gotta walk up on the hill, man. I hope so, inshallah. It's a whole lot. Okay, so we found a good parking spot. 
And now we're headed to the entrance, the gate where we have to buy our ticket, our entrance tickets. People out. <laughs> Muhammad's on my husband's shoulders right now. But yeah, this place is literally so huge. Like, it's so crazy because a lot of people come around looking for knowledge, whether it's Islamic knowledge or just, you know, secular books, Arabic books, all that. But um, a lot of people actually come here. It's like a, um, it's like a get together type of thing, if you know what I'm saying. But yeah, we about to head up there. They got a security checkpoint. So I'm gonna put my phone away, stay focused until we get in. And then inshallah, I'll show you guys some more. You hear music? That's <laughs> Okay, guys, so first we're gonna pray Asr and then we're gonna get some food, or maybe we'll eat and then pray. And then we're gonna head in to go check out the books. I don't even know what I want to eat, honestly, uh, but I'm hungry for something. Yeah, look at the um, food over there. Oh, I remember when we took a picture here last year? Oh my god. Yes, you was just so little. <laughs> I think they did. Oh, that's what they get. That's what they get. <laughs> okay, so last year they had McDonald's, but you know, because of all the stuff that's going on, you know, I'm not seeing no Mickey D. Oh, well. <laughs> Listen, I went out. I, I went without McD's before. I ain't die. We'll be all right. And they got other options. Egyptian-owned companies, you know. So yeah, <laughs> these kids <laughs> taking selfies. But yeah, let's see what we can find to eat. Get us some French fries. You gotta go up this way right here. Oh, okay. How are we gonna do that? Okay, guys, we finally found a place to sit and we finally found some food. Um, so, yeah. So, yeah, um, I got me yeah, a chicken shawarma and I'm getting one of them um, sugar, like, it's like a sweet, it's like has, it's like one of them puff puffs and they put uh, powdered sugar on it. So that's what I'm gonna get um, with my chicken shawarma and fries. And then uh, here next to me, Mohammed. Me? Yeah. See that where they go? Hello. Huh? Y'all, look! Look how he's sitting in the chair. Do y'all believe this baby is only a year and a half? Like that's insane. But yeah, okay. So we're gonna eat. I'll show y'all what the food looks like. Um, and so we're gonna eat and then I'm gonna go pray, find somewhere to pray. And then um, we'll start walking around, inshallah. <laughs> but yeah, I'm so excited. What? Yeah. yeah, what? What are you doing? You going to the bathroom? You using the bathroom? Y'all. Yeah. So this is the food that we got. Is that mine? Right there. I always eat my fries first to see what these looking like. Mm -mm. This one mine? I'm sorry. Wow. I feel like you took two bites. What's that? A taco? Beef. Meat, beef. Okay, this is my chicken shawarma that my husband took a bite out of. And these are my fries. So I'm gonna go ahead and eat and then I'm gonna go ahead and eat and then I'm going to check in with y'all in a little bit after we pray and start going around and looking at the books. They're good. Mohammed, you like them? And we are in here. <gasps> of course. <gasps> thing we see is books as we come in here. 
So Muhammad and my husband are looking at some books for Muhammad. I found this one, the first hundred words. I definitely want to get this for him. Um, yeah, but they have a whole bunch of stuff. I showed you guys the publication at the beginning. This is my pick for Muhammad. How, how can I get this? Okay, so now we have reached the uh, Islamic book section. They have a um, goods publication and distribution company. <laughs> Okay guys, so um, I was able to get two books so far. My husband is over here going ham, um, getting so many books. Um, I kind of want to go back to where he got his books at, his Tafsir books, and get me some books over there. Like, Cause I have a Fatwa book concerning women's issues already that I got last year. And then I got two books like, um, I forgot because they are completely in Arabic. Most of the books here are in Arabic. They have some sections with English and other languages, but most of, for the most part, everything's in Arabic. Uh, I want to find a book that is. Uh, uh, I'm sitting here looking like, dang, you balling out in the book fair, babe. <laughs> I'm trying to go back. Yeah. Yeah, that was only three books. You got a whole collection. Oh. Careful, sorry. My man was like, yo, you need me to change some dollars for you to Africa. It's always something. I really, oh my gosh, I, don't they have like a um, clothing section? I feel like they do. Okay, Mohammed. <laughs> so we are about to go head back to the place where my husband got the tough stair books so that I can try to find um, a book over there for me. Because the most important thing for me when it comes to books is like the author like I need to okay I don't want to you know you know not that I can call somebody a defiant or anything like that but I just want um, to stick to like someone like a Salafi scholar Salafi writer um, and it's hard to tell when you know it's a whole bunch of different publications out here and it's a whole bunch of uh, titles in Arabic, it's very difficult. So what I'm about to do now is I'm, uh, we just got over here. Um, so I'm about to try to check out the books they have here. Uh, and yeah. <laughs> okay, yeah, we, we about to leave because Muhammad is just acting up, y'all. The thing is, it's, it's not even just he's acting up. He's like very, very tired right now. Um, but I was able to get some books. So um, there was this class uh, with the United Muslim Masjid that was going on. And um, it was for the book, Purification of the Soul by Ibn Qayyim. So um, that's the book that I got in Arabic. So I'm gonna try to go through it with the class, inshallah. So yeah, I'm excited. I think I really got some really good choices. It's like a volume though, it's crazy. Yeah. Yeah, books I wanted. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. I told you. That's why I was like 2000 I'm like, hold up. I'm like, sometimes, you know, when your husband got it, he'd be like, yeah, just pay for it. Throw it in the bag. And I'm like, uh-uh. We not finna throw that in the They really tried to, because look, he was about to get his own books, right? And they were about to charge him 24. <laughs> Muhammad. <laughs> They were about to charge him 2,000 and some pounds. He came here, got the books that I wanted, which was like two books, got the books he wanted, which was like another group of books. And all together, it was still less than 2,000. Like, but yeah, we're about to head to the car. Oh, Farouk. Farouk then woke up. Yeah, so 
um yeah it was a good day here at the book fair i loved it so much um i didn't get to see everything but we got to see the places that we really wanted to see um because it's it's multiple buildings and it's each building they have different sections and so the section that we were at was for islamic text and that's pretty much what we came here for um so yeah now we are getting ready to head home I'll um, hit y'all up when we get back in the car. All right. Okay, y'all. So I finally saw the place where they be having like a little bit of clothes and stuff. I'm gonna see if they got anything nice that I would like, and then we're probably gonna head home because uh, Muhammad is so tired. We're gonna probably get something to eat on the way home. And look, Farouk just woke up. We didn't spend like the whole day here. We were literally here for like a couple hours. Like we got here at like 2:30, I would say. And then we had to eat, pray, so we didn't really get to do anything like a lot until about three o'clock, three thirty. Yeah, I like really have a toddler. It's all this boy want to do: be with his abu all day, all night. That's it. Baskets. That's cute. All the stuff was handmade. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I, I didn't see anything I really, really liked for real, y'all. They had some ponchos and stuff, but nothing like that made me be like, oh, yeah, I need this right now. I can't live without it type of deal, you know? So, yeah, it's like super dark outside. So, I'm a. We're gonna um, regroup. When we get back home, so I can show you all the books that I got. All right, you guys, we are home. I'm going to show you guys all the books that we got. Um, but this is the end of the vlog for today. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel um, and click that notification so you will know the next time I post. Inshallah. He is mad tired. He's about to get a bath and go to bed. I promise y'all. He's got to get a bath and go to sleep. <laughs> he might be a little hungry too, so we might give him like a little snack or something before bed. But yeah, dude is out of it. But thank you guys for watching. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Until next time. Okay, so this is the website where you could probably find these books if you look for them. But let me show you. The stuff I got for Muhammad. So, yeah. So, the other one we got was this. It's a night, a bedtime story. Ed had Ila Noam going to bed. So, yeah. Ed had Ila Tabib going to the doctor. Muhammad really loves animals. There's more. And then this one. Owal Maya Kalimat. So, um, and it comes with pictures, which is awesome. Um, because we were pretty much told that when it comes to learning Arabic words, it's best to look at pictures for definitions instead of writing the English definition. These, it's like a little... Um, It's really for three-year-olds and plus, but my son is built like a three-year-old, so whatever. <laughs> uh, yeah. So, I said, Alif. Ba. Bakara. Okay, so now we're gonna get to the Arabic books that I got. I got this book. And this book. These are all books for um, pretty much this. It, I, I'll probably put, put them in the Bible. But anyways, <laughs> this is where you can get it. It's where you can find it. And then I also got these two books. Um, these are... Purification of the soul 
by Ibn by Ibn. Thank, thank you. Fruit by Ibn Qayyim al al what? That's what I thought. But yeah, so there's two editions. So my husband got me both editions. Per okay. Correction. He got me. It's one book, but two volumes. What's this book that you got? What is this? What is this? I don't know what book. I don't know what book. This one. Uh, uh, let me see which one. Uh, it's called A for the Yearning One and Resisting the Traps of Shaitan. Oh. The book is about the tricks of Shaitan and how to protect myself from his influence. Oh, okay. What about this? What's this? That's a book about morning do I. Oh, okay. It's called Al uh, Al the precious pearl, the virtues of morning thicker, a thicker period. Oh, okay. And then this one? Uh, the Kaaba Asarat al Mustaqim by Ibn Taymiyyah. The book is about straight path. Okay. And then this is like a whole volume that you had got, right? Yeah, that's uh, Muhammad Shalkani's Tafsir al Quran. Ah, oh, that's what all this is. Yes, everything in here. <laughs> it's all together. But yeah, that's everything we got. So I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog. Like I said, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel and don't forget to click the notification button. So every time I post, you guys will see it. Thank you guys for watching again. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.